Despite its flaws, Windows remains the most widely used PC OS out there. However, those flaws still haunt a lot of users, and one of the most common problem are with respect to audio. You could have the most beastly hardware, but chances are the sound output would not be that good. Well, if you feel your device needs a little touch up in the audio department, here are some cool tricks you should definitely give a shot. Hi guys, this is Ashish from Guiding Tech and in today's video, we are going to talk about top 5 tricks to get louder and better sound on Windows 10. Now let's begin with the very basic first. The audio is produced by a piece of hardware and for that to work properly, you need to ensure that the latest drivers for the same are installed on your system. Generally, all the major companies notify users whenever there is an update available and if that's the case, you can go ahead to the specific website and directly download the said driver. Alternatively, you can go to device manager and you can use the shortcut keys that's windows key plus X. Here use the right click and select update driver and it's the most simple trick but manages to fix almost 80% of the issues for most of the users out there. Now chances are that you don't have an issue with the overall output of the system but want to change the volume levels for different apps. Well, that is also possible natively in Windows 10. And to set the individual volumes, right click on the volume icon and select open volume mixer. All the open apps will be displayed on the right side while the devices are on the left. All you have to do is adjust the volume as per your liking and you're good to go. Alternatively, you can go to sound settings, other sound options, app volume and set device preference and select the different input and output volumes for apps and devices. Okay, so this was with individual apps. But if you're not satisfied with the overall loudness of the speakers, if that's what you're looking for, Windows actually comes with hidden features using which you can boost the maximum volume by about 150%. To access the sound setting, right click on the volume icon on the taskbar and select sounds. Double click on the speaker icon under playback which will bring up the speaker properties. Now navigate to enhancement tab and check the option for loudness equalization. Do note that not all the devices support this and some audio players might show sign of noise at enhanced levels. Now if you are an advanced user who likes to tinker around to get the perfect sound for each genre of music, an equalizer would definitely be something you'd fancy. Thankfully, Windows 10 comes with a native sound equalizer which lets you tweak the band and create your custom profile. To access the equalizer, go to sound settings and select device properties. Next, click on enhancements and uncheck the equalizer checkbox from the list. Then you can adjust the bands as per your taste and while it's slow and time consuming process, it's definitely worth the time, especially if you're an audiophile like me. If all else fail, you can always resort to third-party solutions. The one that Windows by default recommends is Dolby Atmos for spatial sound. This feature doesn't need any special hardware or receiver, but is indeed a digital signal processor that works by mixing the sound of your PC for an enhanced audio experience. So to enable this feature, go to sounds and double click on an audio device. Once in, select the tab from special sound and select Dolby Atmos for headphones from the drop down list. Alternatively, you can install a full fledged app like Boom 3D. It is one of the best audio boosters out there and it also featured in our list of best music players for Android. It comes with extra equalizer settings, also with pre-configured profiles and a 3D surround sound mode as well to get the best audio experience. Do note that both these options are paid, so you'd have to shell out some cash if you want to get that extra oomph factor from your audiophile ears. Also, speaking of software for Windows 10, we also have a separate video for the 7 must-have apps for the PC, so make sure that you look at them as well once you're done with the audio part, of course. And as well, that was it. Personally, I'd prefer the Boom 3D since it's a complete solution, but your taste may vary. Also, if you find any other trick that we missed out, make sure that you sound off them in the comments section. So guys, this is Ashish from Guiding Tech and I hope to see you in my next one. Until then, take care and have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.